So this is Songbook 1, and inside Songbook 1 contains 10 well-known classical pieces that have been specifically arranged to be worked on after you have finished my initial lessons 1 to 10. All of these pieces are going to be at the perfect level that you will be at after you have finished lesson 10. So this is going to save you time having to hunt around the internet, trying to find more pieces to play after you've finished lessons 1 to 10 that are the exact level for you. This book is aimed at those people that have finished and completed lessons 1 to 10. And once you've completed lessons 1 to 10, where you've learned about how to hold the violin, where to bow, all the open string notes, the first finger, second finger, third and fourth finger notes, you're going to want to put all that into practice. And you can do that with this songbook that contains 10 well-known classical pieces that have been perfectly arranged for you to be able to tackle after you have finished lesson 10 and that is the whole point of this book. So this is something that is pretty much mandatory for you to do before you move on to the next set of lessons which are lessons 11 to 21. Otherwise you're just not going to be able otherwise you're just not going to have that practice Otherwise, you're just not going to have put those skills into practice so that when you move on to the next set of lessons, your music reading isn't going to be as good as it should be. In this book, you're now going to start to hone all those skills that you have been learning throughout lessons 1 to 10. There's one thing learning all the technical side of things, how and where to bow, where to put your fingers, finger one, finger two, finger three, and where all those notes are on the music. But now you've got to put that into practice before you move on to the next level where we're going to be adding more technical stuff. And if you don't practice those things, then moving on is going to be very, very difficult. So as you get further on in this book and you get better and better and better at reading music, moving on to the next stage is going to be a lot easier. But first of all, you've got to learn how to put all of those 16 notes that you will have learned throughout lessons one to 10 into practice in the form of pieces. How long it'll take you to get through this book is quite a difficult question to answer because it is gonna depend on so many factors. But if you were someone who was very, very dedicated, someone who has learned to play the violin from scratch through lessons one to 10, and now you're moving on to this songbook, I would probably suspect that you would be anywhere from sort of three or four weeks playing this. If you're someone who has a little bit of background in music, perhaps you can already play a few other instruments um, or have dabbled in previous years, then going through this book isn't going to take you quite so long. You might not actually have to read the music, so therefore you might just be focusing on actually just playing the violin itself and just getting a good sound and getting a good tune out of the violin. So this could take you anywhere from, let's just say, a month to maybe two, three, four months. But again, it just depends on how much time, effort and dedication you're putting into it. If you're playing every day, then obviously you're gonna get through this book faster. If you are playing sort of a few times a week, then it's gonna take you a lot longer to get through the book. But for me, time is kind of irrelevant and I don't like to put timings on things because I think it puts a lot of pressure on people and it does depend on how quickly people do pick things up and obviously their personal situations. So I would say that, just move on when you feel confident enough that you can play all of the pieces in this book to the best of your ability. This is a 100% downloadable book, as are all of the books in my bookshop. Even though I'm showing you a physical book here, this is just something I have just printed out on my home printer and I have just bound together with one of those spiral bounds. But once you've downloaded the book, the book is yours to keep and you can view it on your laptop, your computer or any kind of mobile device or like I have here, print it out at home yourself. You also have the option of taking it to your local printers and for a little bit of money, they'll print it out professionally for you. You should buy my course because it is the best one out there. It's completely a one of a kind course. There is nothing else out there on the internet that is, is, is similar to this in any way, shape or form. The reason why I think this course is so good is because I have spent many, many years putting this course together, but also I have been a teacher for many years and I've also been an examiner for the London College of Music here in the UK. So I completely understand what it's like to be a student, 
a candidate, examiner, and a teacher. And I understand the violin from all four of those perspectives. And I've put that together with my 25 years of teaching and hundreds and hundreds of students all into this one to 30 violin course that is now available for you guys online. I'm also the biggest and most popular violin tutorial channel on YouTube with over a half a million subscribers. As my teacher always used to say to me, the proof is in the pudding. So if you don't believe me, go ahead, buy the course, read the reviews and you will see why this is such a brilliant course and I guarantee you will be playing in no time. Thank you for watching.